It's a warm, sunny Saturday morning in May, and Evanstonians are taking advantage of the better weather. Why are you out here this morning? Uh, for some breakfast. Yeah, and some tacos. Uh, yes. <laughs> it's opening weekend at the downtown Evanston Farmer's Market, and Katie Warfel is excited for more than just tacos. Uh, it's nice to come and grab local produce in the summer. Um, I don't know, it's a nice thing to do outside when the weather's nice. The market's been a regular Evanston happening for over two decades, and city employee Sinja Valson sees what it adds to the community. So far from what I've heard, it's a great place to come. Families come here. Um, it's been going on for over 20 years, so it's just, you know, yeah, I put this great in place here. to be. Watch. Kenny Stover's been a vendor here since the beginning, and he shares the bright mood of everyone else at the market. So it's opening day of Farmer's Market in Evanston. It happens every Saturday, and we're here to sell some fresh asparagus as well as some of our jarred products today. It's going real well. Good. You know, it's the first day the sun shined in almost a week. So it's the opening day for market. It's not raining, so I'm sure people are happy to be outside in the sun as well as me. This is our... I'd have to double check how many years the market's been running. We've been here since the very first okay. one. The market is held in a parking lot behind the Hilton Garden Inn, something that becomes clear when... <laughs> an alarm goes off inside a nearby parking lot. It's not enough to deter anyone here, especially not Patsy Benaviste, here with Reclaim Evanston, a progressive group in the city that fights for fair housing policy. She's here for a cause, but doesn't mind the chance to get outside. Yeah, but we kind of like it because it's <laughs> get to stand in the sun. Virginia Langmaid, Middle School of Journalism.